intending to do today is uh, try out some different bullets in my uh, 6.5284. Uh, the reason being, up until today, I've been shooting the uh, 140 grain aim axes from Hornady and they work very well. I shoot them out to 1200 yards and they group very well. But they are increasingly getting very expensive, um, nearly comparable to the uh, 140 grain burgers, which these are, the VLDs. I've always fancy shooting the burgers, I've never shot them in this, and uh, what I intend to do today is to shoot two high shot groups and see how they compare. <coughs> both are, or both uh, sets of bu uh, bullets have been seated within 10 thou of the land. Um, these are at about 2.499 to the U drive, and the others are 2.513. So uh, we'll see how uh, what difference they make, if, if, if any. Ballistically, these are a better coup efficiently, but um, I'd like to move on to these, but they need to prove themselves. So um, this is just sort of initial testing uh, to see what happens. Right, let's have a go. And I'm, uh, just to let you know, I'm shooting at 200 yards. There should hopefully, uh, if the second camera works, we'll get some shots on target. Right, it's a nice little group down range. I'll just give it a couple of minutes to uh, cool off. Um, you can see I'm now using the um, Sinclair, well, I don't know what you call it, but it's an adapter for the, uh, like a narrow fore end to make it into a flat fore end so it rides the bags on the um, Sebco axle rest. Um, I've done a review on this already and that is brilliant. And I've now just invested in a Sebco axle, uh, a Sebco axle, a Seb rare bag, and they are very good. I haven't got it right filled up with uh, as much sand as I can get in it, so it's a little bit squishy, but that seems to work really well. Um, before anybody asks, I'm using 51 and a half grains of 4831 SC uh, powder in here, and uh, that should give me a velocity of about 2890 FPS. Uh, and I'm getting the extreme range is about, well, extreme spread is about 20 feet, which for some reason I can't get it down anymore. But um, I'm using a Federal 210 primer, so maybe I need to change that. To, but at the moment, it seems to work for me, so I'll stick what I want. Right. It's on target anyway. A little bit high. heavy lift bolt lift there. Uh, when I get home I will check the uh, cases. I'll put 
them one up that way so I know they're the uh, fieldy. The group is actually opening up a little bit which is quite surprising. You'll see it on camera. I've got all uh, got a second camera down there so there or thereabouts but not as tight as I'd like. This is pretty warm now. Right, what I'll do now is I'll uh, take the camera down the bottom end and uh, We'll have a look at the groups. The uh, group on the left hand side, so I remember, is the Hornady 140 Amex and the group on the right hand side are the 140 grain Burger PVLDs. Thank you. Right, um, I've just walked back up here and uh, these ones on the left here were the uh, 140s, uh, the uh, Hornady Amex. There's a little bit shooting to the right, I was aiming at the dot obviously. And these ones are the burger. Now the burger is okay, but the first shot, that was the first shot, and then we got a bit of a group, so I don't know. Um, I'll have to play about with that. They prefer, may prefer to seat, be seating, uh, touching the land, so I'm 10 to out at the moment, so I'll, I can alter that a little bit. But I'm pleased with them, but they just need uh, Rosero. Uh, thank you very much. Well, well, while I'm here, for other videos, it smells very much of fox hair, since my house is just over the back here. We might get one on camera later. We'll try. Bye. Thank you. Please subscribe to my channel.